The AMP study is all about BNAVs, and they might just be a great new tool in preventing the spread of HIV. But what are they? BNAVs are broadly neutralizing antibodies. Our bodies normally produce antibodies, which help fight infection and disease. And most of the time, our antibodies do a great job. But fighting HIV isn't so easy. HIV is tricky because every time it makes copies of itself, it changes a little. This means normal antibodies have trouble keeping up with those changes and blocking the virus. But BNABs are special, rare antibodies. These antibodies target HIV's weakness. They latch onto the virus, covering up the parts that HIV uses to attach to our cells. And those parts don't change, even when HIV is making copies. That means BNABs can neutralize lots of different forms of HIV from around the world. In one upcoming study, we will test HIV against a BNAB called VRCO1. This BNAB was found in a person with HIV who was able to stay healthy without medication for over 10 years. And if that wasn't exciting enough, researchers have figured out how to make BNABs in the lab. They're made without using any infected cells or real HIV. So it's impossible for them to cause an HIV infection or AIDS. These special antibodies could play a part in developing new ways to combat HIV infection and maybe one day creating an effective HIV vaccine. The AMP study is an international study that is testing if the VRCO1 BNAB can prevent HIV infection. And the results? might just help researchers around the world develop new ways to stop the spread of HIV. Check out our other videos and visit our website to learn more about the AMP study and its role in HIV prevention.